what's going on y'all welcome back thank y'all for watching and hanging out with your girl telly right now so let's get into this topic summer walker has been trending once again this time not for her music but for getting her new boyfriend's name tattooed on her face yes that's right she got a tattoo that says larry somewhere right up in here you're gonna see it um you already see it on the thumbnail so and then Larry got Summer somewhere up in here. Now, Summer Walk, you just did a whole album dogging your ex, London on a track, and then you immediately jump into a new relationship with this guy. Like, who is this guy, man? It's like you, it, like you're trying to tell other people, other women to like learn from their mistakes and heal and move on but you're not really setting the best example right now you know i'm i'm you know it's cool if she thinks she found love again but did you have to get the dude's name tattooed on you i mean it's it's not going to last forever i highly doubt it's going to lead to marriage or something like that she better be careful she gonna mess around and have another one another kid with no ring and then it's just like if people you know people get on summer walker they you know they dragging her like girl <laughs> you trying to tell us how to move on and learn from mistakes but it seems like she's not really learning or i don't know if she is she got a real funny way of showing it i i don't know i don't know about this one um let me know what you guys think about that but moving on, Saweetie, people have been coming at Sweetie for the past, you know, a few days. First, her SNL performance was like, it wasn't the best. Let's just keep it a buck. It wasn't the best. She was like really out of breath and she just had trouble like, you know, bringing it all together, you know. And it is, it is what it is at this point. She need to go back in the lab, get in some more rehearsals, work on that, um, that breath control and, you know, get your stamina up and things like that. And I think once she does that, then she'll be all right. But people got a lot to say because she's been putting out that she wants a baby and things like that. But people are like, okay, well, you want the baby, but sis where's where's the man where's the like where's the husband like please 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 do not get pregnant and have a baby without being married you know what i'm saying it's it's not it's not going i mean i know you sweetie you got money this that and the third but you're gonna make it harder on yourself and a lot of people in the, the comments when it was posted on the shade room are like girl like no no, 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 please don't, please don't do that. So let me know what you all think about that situation. And, um, yeah, somebody said, don't, don't say that too loud for future or Nick Cannon, child. Lord have mercy. But we're going to move on to the next topic. Your girl, Wendy Williams. Now there's been a rumor going around that she is like early, has, um, got like the early stages of dementia going on which is not true apparently they reported it on ricky smiley morning show which is huge so i don't know where that came from but her brother came out to squash all of those rumors and we know that wendy williams and her brother aren't even like super tight like that like their relationship is a little rocky but he came out and he squashed all of those um, rumors about her having dementia. Now, she does have health issues. She has, um, what is it, Graves disease, I believe. And then she's got some like type of thyroid disease that kind of make her, um, you know, sometimes when you're watching her, her feet look like really, really big on TV. You'd be like, damn, what? Like, when they feet and swelled up. But it's it's got something to do with, you know, her thyroids and that's, what kind of led to her, you know, the infamous episode, Halloween episode, child, when she passed out a few years ago. I can't believe it's been a few years already. I remember I was at work at my desk and I just see everything coming on my phone like, 
Wendy Williams passed out live on her show. I was like, what? But anyway, she does not have dementia. And there are people like, oh, this is her karma. Da 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 da. Because the way that she treats people, but she talked bad about people. Look. It's it's Wendy Williams. She's not the only one who has ever gossiped about people. Yeah, she takes it to like a level a thousand. But I mean, just because she does that, you shouldn't wish people to have dementia or like you know, damn near um you know be close to death. Like that's 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 a bit much. That's a bit much. So, Wendy says she will be back whenever she feels better, but she is a woman of a certain age, so she's just, you know, taking it slow. In the meantime, she's got hosts filling in, her guest hosts filling in. I think today is Remy Ma and Fat Joe um, hosting, and it is 12 o'clock, so that happened already, um, at least on in the East Coast, Eastern Standard Time. But, um... Yeah, let me know what you guys think about those three topics. Summer Walker with the tat of her boyfriend on her face. Sweetie wanting a baby just because she just wants a baby. And Wendy Williams and her health, uh, you know, her health issues. And do you think she will even make a comeback to the Wendy Williams show? She says she will, but I don't know. Maybe it's time to... Go ahead and retire. It's like she left her mark. Her legacy is, is you know, is set in stone. So, I don't know. Maybe it's time for her to maybe do a podcast. She could set that up at her house. And, you know, she don't have to really go nowhere or do anything. Do, have her own damn Wendy Williams live on YouTube. Psh, that'll blow up. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. But let me know what you guys think about that. Appreciate y'all for watching. It's your girl, Telly. Television 87 is the channel. I'll talk to you guys again real soon, all right? Until then, peace.